So one of the surprise beers I found, uh, I think it was this past spring or summer, was the um, Owl's Brew Watermelon Rattler. It was a, like a light beer brewed with white tea, uh, some watermelon juices, agave nectar, things like that. And I actually really enjoyed it. It was a nice light beer. It was a little sweet, uh, something a little different. And it turns out that they have a whole bunch more of these. Uh, so today I have Owl's Brew Rattler the Blonde. Uh, this is a wheat beer brewed with spices uh, and blended with black tea, citrus juices, and agave nectar. Uh, so if it's anything like the watermelon one, this should be pretty good. Although sometimes I am a little uh, cautious when something is just labeled as spices. So pretty golden colored, nice white head, getting some fruit scents from it. And I don't know if it was visible on that, but it looked like it was pouring a little thicker, like it sometimes does with juices. And just like the watermelon rattler, yeah, this is, um, it's nice, light, and sweet. Um, the black tea, I think, has kind of a natural sweetness to it. Uh, helped by that agave nectar and the, what was it, just citrus juice. And of course, uh, wheat beers, a lot of time, work really well with citrus juices. So the whole thing just goes together really well. Uh, I actually have two more of Owl's Brew uh, Rattlers, but those are leaning a little more into winter, uh, winter flavors. So I'll probably be covering those later. But if you're out, uh, again, I got this at Total Wine over on um, over in Newport News. If you're out and you see this, or at this point, I'm going to go ahead and say any of the Owl Brew Rattler stuff, give it a shot. I've been really happy with it so far.